Goodwill can be a human quality, but also a Brahma quality. If it's a human quality, we have goodwill for the people we like, the people who've done good things for us, and not for anybody else. And if that's our goodwill, it turns into what the Buddha calls agati, or wrong courses of action. It becomes obvious who we like, who we don't like, who we're deluded about, who we're afraid of. When that becomes obvious in our actions, then, then we can't rise above the human level. But this, we want to raise our minds up to a Brahma level. Okay, we think about well for all beings, even the people we don't like, the people we're afraid of, the people who're afraid of us. You don't try to take advantage of their fear, and you don't let your fear and likes cause you to behave in ways that are unfair. Because goodwill is not just an attitude that you have while you sit and meditate for a while and then forget about it. It's a commitment that you want to act on goodwill to all the people you meet. It's not like dedicating merit. When you dedicate merit, it's actually up to the person receiving the dedication to approve or not approve. That's how they will receive the merit or not receive it. Then your job is done. Once you've dedicated it, that's it. But with goodwill, you're committed. You try to treat all people in a fair way in a way that will be conducive to their genuine happiness. And that takes work. It's not a natural attitude. Sometimes you hear that if you strip away the mind's social conditioning, you get down to an innate goodwill. We look at little kids who haven't been socially conditioned, and they have goodwill for their friends and ill will for people who hit them or hurt them. That's the normal human quality of the mind. We're trying to raise the quality of the mind. So when you tell yourself, well, it's only natural that you have your likes and dislikes. But that's it. It's only natural. You want to rise above natural. You want to rise above human nature. We've taken on this human form, but the mind doesn't have to stay on a human level. It can rise to a higher one, but it can also fall to a lower one. So you have to be careful. Do your best to maintain at least a human level and raise it above it. So that your actions will be skillful all around, because that's why we have goodwill, is to remind ourselves that we want to behave skillfully with people, no matter how they've behaved in the past, no matter much they've hurt us or offended us. We still have to have goodwill, because we want to make sure that our goodness doesn't depend on their goodness, because we, as we've seen, their goodness is not all that reliable. We want to have an independent source of goodness inside. So try to maintain this attitude. As the Buddha said, make it large like the earth, make it broad like the river Ganges. Make your mind like space. People can try to scribble all over it, but nothing sticks. When you've done that, you've raised your mind to a higher level, a level that really is appropriate for someone who's practicing the Dharma.